I decided to take a little breaky break. I was posting back to back to back the sum in the summer. So, you know, I took a little break in August. There was not anything going on for real. Like, literally not much going on. So, didn't miss anything. But, super exciting. I have a collective vacation haul for you guys today. Featuring items from Shein, Pretty Little Thing, Jaded London, Addicted, and more. So, more to come. So just stay tuned. Be sure to hit that subscribe button because I promise you're not gonna you're not gonna want to miss out. You're not gonna want to miss out. And also be sure to follow me on all my socials to see how I style these items. This haul is gonna be strictly me showing them. Um, maybe I'll give you guys like some of my ideas. But if you guys wanna see more, follow me on my socials and be sure to subscribe so that we can see my upcoming vacation vlog for my birthday coming up soon. I'm going to Spain and I'm super excited. It's only great that I show you guys what I'm bringing. I have a lot to show you guys so I'm gonna walk through the items pretty fast but I'm gonna still try to be as detailed and descriptive as possible and show you guys all the good things I got. So let's get into Shein first. Starting with some shoes. I just got these white strappy sandals. I love strappy sandals like this because it still gives that look that you want with heels without having to hurt your feet. I've been meaning to get me a white pair so I got a white pair for this trip and Trust she will be put to use. The next thing that I got are just these uh, straw sandals. They're kind of like Christian, like Dior inspired for sure. But I think these would be super cute because I feel like Spain, even though when I looked up like the style out there, it kind of gives like a little bit of New York with like a European flair. But <laughs> um, I definitely am still gonna go for like the whole boho esque, lots of like puffy things, lots of like hippie boho kind of vibes even though i know like that's not really the vibe there in barcelona at least but ibiza is a different story but i got these sandals they're super cute um, i'm probably gonna pair this with like, an all white outfit but we'll see the next thing that i got is a little bit cute and a little bit young like i think this is probably like not as mature as the vibe that i wanted to give for this because i'm turning 25 but i thought it was cute so i put it in my cart so here is the uh, bottoms just this butterfly bathing suit definitely a very cheeky definitely a cheeky vibe here then here is the top super small and itsy bitsy teeny weeny but i think this is super cute probably something i'll wear on a little bit more of a like a chillax day like not trying to do too much but i still you know want to be out lounging out by the pool this next bathing suit i got kind of reminds me of the tequila bottles i'll show you guys it kind of reminds me of this tequila bottle but here it is here's the bottoms it's kind of like the same like kind of print and vibe just in like the reverse color so it's like this black and blue number Ooh, super cute and it also has like some yellow details it kind of reminds me of um versace a little bit i think this actually isn't strapless i think it goes through the center i'm honestly not a big fan of bathing suits that look like this so i don't know why i even put it in my car but we'll see how it looks on me when i try it on and you guys have seen the try on porch the next pair of shoes i got are so hot and so barcelona spain-esque like they're just these really cute brown wooden heels and they have like all these like wooden details these look a lot more expensive than they actually are like these look really really hot like very very designer very fashion-esque like i'm probably probably gonna wear these for pictures i don't think this is like feasible to walk in but i don't know we'll see maybe i'll be feeling the vibes i'll be inebriated and then i'll be able to wear these and not even care but these are so cute i look like really really cute really love this one this next bathing suit is kind of like a elevated play on a plain white bathing suit so the top is just this plain like textured triangle top so nothing too crazy i'll come up and show the texture a little bit later and then the bottoms hello it's white so it's probably gonna mess with the lighting but the bottoms have like this cute like gold detailing on the back like this is definitely cheeky like if you're not one of them girls don't even do it don't even try it don't even attempt but i kind of want to attempt like i feel like this would be so cute in ibiza so here's the detail on it really really cute and then this is what i was talking about with the texture so it's like a white textured bathing suit so this bathing suit has a lot of layers and elements to it that i really enjoy so happy about that the next thing that i got which i think is like a barcelona staple like i feel like i'm gonna look like every other girl in here but it's just this a super cute ruffled white maxi skirt and again lighting is gonna mess up a little bit but it's super cute like wait till y'all see this in a try on portion this would like 
I'm gonna show you guys I got an accessory to go with this. I got this gold belt from Shein as well to go with it. Let me show you guys proper. Okay, and I also really like have been meaning to get a belt like this. I kind of want the ones that are even, has my fly literally been open this whole time? I kind of want the bigger ones please, but I'm really, really excited for this. Like, it's just so cute. Like, wait till it all comes together. You guys will see. Another top that I got is just this really cute, like, tassel fringe top. It's actually cream, but it's not really showing up cream right now. I'll come a little bit closer. Yeah, as you guys can see, it has, like, this tassel detail, like, these little little beady, beady things. What would I, what would you call this? And it has, like, this pink and blue, like, border around it. I thought this would be really cute just for, like, a casual, like, day, like, a regular casual day, like, in Ibiza. I think this is, like, perfect for that, so... I'm excited I got this. And another thing that I got is this waist chain. This is like seashelly waist chain, which I thought would be like a really cute vibe by the pool, by the beach. Like, I'm excited for her. And then I have these gold strappy sandals, which again, like I was telling you guys, like I really want to give like that elevated look without having to actually wear heels. Like, I want to be able to have something sensible on my feet. Another accessory I got is just this little waist chain here this one is like one of the elastic ones um but it's blue and it has like these like little butterfly and shell and pearl details on them if you guys can tell that okay this next piece of jewelry that i have is just this really nice like gold bangle like a stone like little band around it it's really cute but it doesn't really fit me so i'm, I'm wondering if i can like oh i can close it a little oh i should have done that when it was on the thing but it's really, really cute. Not really a jewelry girl, but I told myself I was going to get into jewelry a little bit more for this trip. On the note of getting into jewelry, I also want to get into silver jewelry because I have tons of gold pieces, but I have no silver pieces. And sometimes I want to do silver, but I don't have a lot. So I just got this set of um silver bangles. There's this one, which is like a little hand. This one's just like a regular, regular like opening here. And then this one is like a little twisty twisty one it's a regular chain which i probably won't wear as much because this probably is like not really the vibe that i want and then another one of those like tribal tribal ones got another cute set of bangles as well these are more like those neutral colors and i think this would pair really well with that other bracelet that i showed you guys and with a lot of the outfits that i have another bracelet that i got it's very cheap like basically paper but it's just this wooden bangle and i thought that this would be cute i don't know like i feel like I need to get more into jewelry and this is the way to start. It's kind of itchy. Last but not least for accessories, how cute is she? This is just like this nice like spirally necklace. I feel like you guys have been seeing this. You probably have seen this like around a lot. But I think this would look really cute with that maxi skirt that I showed you guys. And just like really like bring together the whole vibe that I'm trying to give for this vacation. Like I really want to give like boho chic kind of vibes and i think like this is like a staple if you want to go for that style last thing from shein i got these purple sandals i wanted a little pop of color but the bag that i got for this doesn't match the shoes so i don't know if i'm going to actually bring these on vacation but these are really cute hopefully i can find some use for this eventually but i don't know if it's going to make it with me on vacation last item from shein i think is just this a bodysuit this is more of like a casual vibe as well um, it's kind of like, it kind of reminds me of like Zara quality. It's that slinky material and it's in this nude color. I don't know if that's translating well on camera, but you can't really tell how this is supposed to look. So in the try on portion, I'll show you guys, but I would wear this with just like some shorts for like a nice casual, like over oh, grabbing breakfast really quick or something along those lines. This, and next bathing suit is a little bit complicated. I just like spent some time trying to figure it out, but it's just this brown um, bathing suit with these blue beaded details and this metal like ring in the center maybe like my blue bag i can also add this like pop of color my friend got me this bag for my birthday that'll be a really good ibiza spain barcelona piece um but i think yeah i think this is the top because i'm i've been trying to figure out what this is and yeah i definitely think this is the top and the bottoms have that same like blue metal stone um detail i think this is really really cute and i'm definitely wearing this in the visa like please you cannot tell me nothing about this on the pretty little thing website the girl styled it with this um wrap here and i think i'm gonna do the same thing it's just this netted brown wrap super cute just to wear around like a beach club or something so i got the top and then i also got the matching sarong bottom i definitely probably could have just got the bottom i don't think i need both but you know i'm a set girl Another thing that I got, but silly me didn't get the top to it. So 
won't be able to wear this but i got the bottom maybe i'll get the top later but here's what it looks like it's just this really cute black flower detail with the um clear sides i'm also like not a big fan of clear sides because one i think they're like really easy to break and two they're not adjustable and sometimes i need to adjust because I'm not the thickest. Next one, pretty little thing. I just got this gold satin skirt. It kind of has like this mermaidy um, styling detailing to it. Does it have a slit? I don't think it has any slits, but I'm probably gonna wear this with like a nice white shirt and some white sandals, like a nice casual day out, like you know, nothing too crazy. Like I said, I'm really going for like that flowy esque vibe, and I think that this definitely fits that. So. This is really cute. I probably will wear this again too. Like I think this is going to get a lot of wear. Let me show you guys two things that really disappointed me in this whole haul. So I got this green dress. And I thought it was going to be super cute and fit me so nice. It does not fit me well. I mean to be honest, when I got it, I was like, dang, I don't think I really have anything that would match this. like, Or any shoes that I think would fit. But yeah, so maybe it was just like a divine intervention or something. But this dress is not flattering on me at all. I'll try it on for you guys and show you guys what I'm saying so you guys don't think I'm crazy. But this ain't it. I'm and then next, another thing I was really disappointed in. And I feel like it looked so good on the model. I went a picture. It looks so good on the model. And then when I got it, I was like, is this the same dress? Because I literally went on Pretty Little Thing. I was like, wait, is this the same? But it's just this blue satin dress. I thought this would be a cute like number. But the straps are not adjustable. The boob part sits a little weird um it doesn't really like frame the it does nothing for the body because it's satin so it has no stretch no nothing so it literally does nothing for me so this was a fail like a fail i also got another pair of platform heels i don't know why i'm so obsessed with the brown platforms but these are a little bit different they are fully brown and they have like these gold setting around it and the heels like this nice chocolate square kind of looks like a um crunch bar yeah i don't know if i'm gonna bring these i also don't think that these are as comfortable as the other ones so we'll see like which ones win but i'm really leaning towards the other ones because these i think might not be the vibe for this but i hope i can wear these somewhere else I got these heels from Pretty Little Thing. They're just these like black lace pointed toe shoes. And I got these because I got this dress from Jada London. I actually had to go get it altered so I won't be able to try it on for you guys. But make sure you subscribe. Tune into my vlog. You'll see me wear it in a pizza in a Barcelona. But they're these pink um, lace heels and they go so good with the dress. I'll insert the dress on the side. But like I said, I'm going to showcase it in my vlog. But these are so cute. They're really comfortable. The heel's pretty tall, honestly. Like, I feel like it could have went a little shorter. Like, I don't think for this kind of style, the heel needs to be this high. But hey. Last for pretty little thing, I just have this shell bathing suit. This is what the bottom looks like. It's in this orange color. And then the detailing on the side are just these, like, seashells. And then the actual, like, string is this, like, rope texture. I thought that this was a little bit different, a little bit edgier, like, a little bit more fun. Tropical Ibiza vibes, you know? This is what the top looks like. It's a little bit more incy wincy teeny weeny. And then definitely, like, you see the rope texture here as well. So, love that. So the other um, items that I got off of other websites. I got this dress from Jaded London. I'm a Jaded London girl. I feel like everybody gonna have this dress, but honestly, I gotta be everybody because it's really cute, but... To the untrained eye, you don't even t recognize the sparkles, but it's so nice and sparkly, especially like on my skin. Like, this looks so good. I cannot wait to take a picture in this. Like, this is like one of my main ones I wanna take a picture in, like meh. It's really, really long, and the sleeves kinda do like this, um, like the little flare thing, so it gives you like a little bit more sexy old shine, even though I'm wearing a fully mesh up suit. And I think I'm just gonna wear some green um, bathing suit bottoms so that way like my whole butt not out. I also shopped on Addicted for this trip too. It was a spur of the moment kind of thing, but when I went on their website, look what they had. Look, look what they had. I had to get it, like I had to get it. Do you see this? The only thing I wish, I wish I got it in a smaller size, but it was my first time shopping on this site so I didn't really know if it was gonna be too tight and I'd rather it be like just a little bit loose, but you know, not too bad. So. Yeah, I got this top, so I'll probably just tie it in the back with a scrunchie. Like, it's really not that deep. And I think I want to go to the thrift store and get some jorts to pair with this. I'll probably wear this with, like, my Air Forces or something. But this is, like, I had to get, like, I had to. Y'all know I Another thing that I got just for, like, you know, regular day-to-day -day lounging, walking around the villa, 
um going to get food going to get lunch whatever the vibes i just got this um white romper it is ribbed i know like white is a little bit risque but this is ribbed so i think that the quality is a lot better and it's less see-through because it's um ribbed and it does have like this open back situation here from etsy i got me and my friends these cheetah girl inspired headbands and we're gonna wear this to the airport i'm so excited i'm so excited I will link the Etsy seller down below. I think she only has blue, this color, and like a cheetah, like a real cheetah color. But I'm so excited for these. Like, Next, I have something that is a custom made piece from my good sis Zoya from her brand. And she made me this really cute white um set. So it has like that same like blue beading. Um, kind of similar to like the belly chain that I've showed you guys so far and everything. She left me like a little bit more space just in case um I need to cut it or anything like around my neck and then it does like do this little tie in the back and she also made a cute little mini skirt to go with it are you literally dumb I'm a little thick now so I hope this fit but if not I'm still gonna wear it and last but not least this is the final item here's my actual birthday dress so like <laughs> do you see how sparkly she is this girl is fully mesh so it's a fully mesh like halter open back dress it's really low cut at the bottom too it's maxi and then at the bottom it does have like these little ruffles it did come with an underwear and bra to match so it came with this like this sparkly underwear so cute and then it came with the bra i will say like my one critique is that the bra is a little bit too big for me like and also the glitter does get everywhere i don't mind that like that's fine i just don't like glitter on my face i don't care if it falls anywhere else but yeah and that's from um little bit brand and i'll link everything in this haul down below but whoo we got through it that completes this collective vacation haul i know it's super late in the year to be doing vacation hauls but i feel like if you're a virgo like me or if your birthday is coming anytime later in the year and you're going on vacation you're gonna need a haul like this so if you like this video be sure to like this video. Don't forget to follow me on all my socials so you guys can see how I style these pieces. And also, don't forget to subscribe to my channel so you don't miss out on any of the Barcelona, Ibiza, Spain content. But I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.